Welcome back, Gunners. Let's start kicking ass this week. Um, we've got a bunch of things to do. Hopefully, we can have this motor in the car this week. But we've got some fine things that we have to take care of. And that's basically it. Some fine touches that we have to take care of. Some small details. I'm going to rebuild a caliper with you today. I'm going to teach you guys how to do it. Uh, we're going to wait for Trappy to get here. We might start teaching you some more stuff. But... Whatever the case may be, man, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog and uh, like as you're watching right now. You got to like the video. You got to show love. You got to show support. Ain't nobody asking you for money. Just hit the like button. Keep going. All right. All right, now. All right, guys. All right, guys. All right. All right, so. All right. All right, guys. Yep, all right. All right, guys. All right. All right, so. Okay, boys. You got something to say, Forty? Yeah. Hi. Well, Gunners, to no surprise, we went with yellow calipers. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen them. This lighting is making them look a little too bright. I have to rebuild this, right? So I'm using some grease, some Honda grease. I have my piston here, my rebuild kit. This is a part number from this company here. I don't know if you guys can find it. But that's it. Just get a caliper rebuild kit. I've got the extra rubbers over there and stuff. A little, little pick set. Basically, this is how it looks. So, again, the, the lighting is a little too bright. We got it to match pretty close with the color. It's actually almost dead on, but yeah, let me teach you guys how to do this. So this job is a little tedious. You just got to be a little uh, patient with it. Let's get our kit open here. The grease is important. The grease is very important. This stuff right here. Very, very important. So we'll take our kit out. We're going to get a few rubbers that go inside. Uh, maybe like a metal ring here. This one's going to obviously go in first. And then this one goes onto the piston, which is this guy here. So just bear with me. Get our caliper. Start greasing it. Start lubing her up. Pause. Inside here. Now, when you're rebuilding a caliper, just make sure everything inside, which is what I went through already, just make sure everything is out. Make sure you got no grease, you know, I was going to say grease. Um, you got no buildup inside, no corrosion. So these obviously got powder coated, and that's it. So this guy here, this ring, I'm going to grease this ring up. Trust me, it's a sloppy, sloppy job, but... It's going to work out nice. So just make sure this guy is here. And he is going to... This is this is, this is caliper is going to end up dirty until I wipe it with grease. So this second... This groove inside, you'll see it somewhere in here. It goes in. Just get... Maybe one side on. I wish I had another camera... Cameraman here. To help me record, but... I'm stuck with what I'm stuck with. <clears throat> Push this ring up. Again, this is tedious. Don't rush. Just take your time, boys. Come on, there it is. Okay. So our ring is sitting in there. Inside the slot that it needs. Now the next thing you should put is this snap ring, if, if it's called a snap ring or whatnot. This goes on the very top here, goes into this groove. So now does this need grease too, Aki? Why not? You got some on your fingers. Go ahead. Put it on. Put it on. That's it. It just sits right there. This is blurry, right? It's like blurry when I... I don't know. Now, this guy, the piston, right? Really important that this gets greased really well. So, we take some of this guy here again, and we just put it everywhere. Every single where we can. I'll use this guy to sit it on, too. 
now this is this is also oh it's always good to do because um you know just want to clean up your your brake system i'm also going with uh ebc reds which those are, have uh produced the least amount of uh the least amount of dust i've seen people put them on white rims and they came out great so we got our grease there this lip faces down so this should be on top this is the bottom now i have my piston already i'm putting the ring just like this facing down and halfway through it so hopefully this is a smooth transition and grease is very very important man it's just going to make your life a lot more a lot much easier take off this fitting here to get some air out of it come on man this caliper looks like a mess right now Okay, here we go. Sometimes you could actually just press it on with your hand. And sometimes, okay, right there. So that's going to fall in. We're going to push this inside of this ring. And that's it. We're done. We are finished, Gunners. That's it. Finito. That rubber ring is sitting nicely in there. Now, when you press, when you push this guy out, when you bleed it, you'll see that, you know, this will expand out with it. But this is finished. Now, I'm just going to clean it up, wipe it down a little bit, and um, I hope that was a good explanation. I'm not really, this is like basically my first time ever doing it. I watched some awesome uh, DIYs, and that's it. Worked out good. Choppy's here, picked up some axles. Uh, we got some 06 to 11 axles, uh, just getting the rust off, I'm brushing all the boots, cleaning everything up real good. Um, I've got some metal wire brush, I've got some just regular brushes, and uh, using just some, some simple, simple green. Some simple old, simple green. I got the half shaft pretty much cleaned up there. We're going to paint all this black, nice and easy. We're going to tape off the boots, tape off the shaft, uh, well the splines actually pause. And, um, and get those ready for paint but yeah i also picked up a, a carcept uh, ac power steering delete kit this is going to get scuffed acetone cleaned as usual i stripped it down all the way so we're just preparing we're just prepping we're just honestly we're just working oh gunners our uh, axles are all cleaned all crispy they're mint minty for now uh, Trappy ended up taping them up and then we're just going to trim black all of this into going to paint this all into trim black. I don't know why this lighting is the lighting man this hold on hold on hold on guys let me fix this let me fix this for you yeah there it is all right there it is there it is there it is mint, mint. so paint these guys make them look nice because we don't want to end up going on to these doing the uh, half shaft now I'm going to put this in this beautiful chassis and then you've got all that rust that's going to be sitting under here. So we're emphasizing now. We're taking care of the axles. These We're not using the ABS rings, so it's fine. We're going to keep them and just paint them black. But it's coming out good. We'll paint them soon. Put some heat on. Trappy working on the GTR harness. Coming soon, Mackie. Mackie Buckets. Got this guy here. He's all dried up. Got the half shaft up, heat running. Two coats on it, one more coat and I'm finished. Got the other guy here, looking good so far. And that's what we got right now, man. Wish we had more parts. Wish we had more parts, Gunners. But tomorrow's gonna be a better day because tomorrow we're getting parts. And tomorrow, I might give you guys a coupon code to get some real dope drip. But that's neither here or there. We're just gonna. That's part, Trappy. No, I'm taping. Getting to see all that nice work. Nah, prep. Nah, you cut that paint, Trap. Last couple weeks, you went on right wrist. Been on 
been on Vigilante. You've been, you been on Migos. Been on Vigilante. Been on that Max B when he was home wave. Oh, cabron. How much tape you put on here, cabron? I'm gonna make sure you ain't gonna over Oh, man. Yeah, you, you, you gonna do it right or, or what you gonna do? Nah, I gotta do it right. Oh, all right. Chill. See that? You see that? Chill. Fall back. Yeah, exclusive chair here. <laughs> this ain't no City Island shit, bro. That shit popped up the this side shit, Yeah, this ain't no City Island shit. Now, if you're wondering why I'm not using a razor, there's a boot behind it. And I'm not trying to open up that boot. I hear rice outside. This is crazy out there. Something pointing traffic. Axel, though. Clean the rubber too, Gaudon. Man, Gaudon, this thing look like a drive shaft shop. <laughs> this thing look like a drive shaft shop right now, kid. They hate it on Jesus too. Yeah. They hate it on Jesus Christ. I seen them. Twelve, hate on twelve them. haters, right? He only had twelve. Ooh. Nah. We almost done, Gunners. I know this isn't uh, too exciting, but. This this feels good. This feels good, boys. Alright. Oh, go back. What's putting out there, bro? Happen. Oh yeah. Oh, look at that line, God. Along. These things look brand new. DSS, who this? Drive shop shop. Who are you? Who? Who are you? Alright, last one. Last one, Trappy. This one should be easier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Almost simple. And we are done. Wow. We got a straight line. Don't play with my Stop tape, John. Stop playing with it. <laughs> <laughs> Thumbnail? Yeah, look at that, though. Zoom in on that, buddy, buddy. Nice. Nice uh, brush. Yeah. Good job, Trappy. Good job on the tape, good job on the prep, good job on the paint. Done. Yeah, I told you. Yo. I told you I smelt rice. Yo, I heard I it. I told you I, I smelt rice. It. I heard it. Look what was. I told you I rice. Was. Teddy Technology and Fluffy. Uh, My man. Uh, they yeah. made the vlogs and they brought the alternator. God damn, you guys are shitting gold today. All right. You know you can eat off this boy. thing, man. Yo, yeah. I know you. I know you guys know something about eating. Yeah, we not this fancy. I got it. <laughs> yeah. I, I, you know why I'm coming at you like this? Y'all wanna know why? What's up? I ain't know you had screenshots from the gun cast. Yeah, oh, I ain't know you had screenshots with the blonde hair trying to style on me. <laughs> hey, hey, man, I got jokes for these niggas. Yeah. Yeah. I got some jokes for these niggas, man. Yeah. Shut up. <laughs> Every Bronx nigga outfit. Under Armour, yo, yo. with socks. Yo, it's socks. Under Armour with socks. Don't forget the socks, yeah. Yeah. Don't yeah. Forget the yo, socks love. Chill, and they talking they talk that jazz, too, against <laughs> CT, yo. This just got any freeze on the yeah, that. Yeah, I ain't see CT, dude. <laughs> they got any freeze. <laughs> yeah. Yo, I, got an LSD never for my, I got an LSD for my boy Teddy, man. I'm going to take it out for you, boss. Word, word. You out here trying to race for no LSD. Teddy, you had to chill. Time to get hard, man. Nah, I feel you, I feel you. We got you, we got you. Chill, oh, chill, hold on, let's get this. I'll just get this, hold on. They probably play with my fucking tape job, man. They probably play with my tape job, I can't play with it. Bronx, y'all know about this. <laughs> Yo, yeah, what? Y'all know about this. Hell, y'all know about this, man. Hell, y'all know. Yo, Trav, I think you got the camera on the wrong focus, God. Nah, nah, I'm all right. No, wait, what's going on? Yeah, exactly. You think it's supposed to oh, be I'm on auto? The highlights? What, is, what am I on? I'm not on auto? So, nah, just stop recording. I'll nah, fix it. Nah, nah. Well, Gunners, there goes our end result of our axles. Just took a little elbow grease, some time, and he looked brand new, man. Loving them. Trappy's still there working on that GTR harness. I've ran out of things to do. So I got to edit this video and upload it for you guys. I know you've been waiting for some updates. Uh, also put the clutch line on from uh, Stash Auto. Put that guy up there. I've just been doing small tedious things that really don't need too much coverage. And uh, that's it. But we'll definitely get more stuff done tomorrow.
Well, Gunners, as usual, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you think. I know we didn't do too, too much. It doesn't look like that on camera, but we got a lot done today. We got to help Teddy and Fluff. We gave him an LSD that I had sitting here, and uh, I gave him some ball joints and some extra parts for their car. I just want to see them do better in life. You know what I mean? I, if I can guide them into the right direction, I'd, I'd rather do that than leave them go out. I care about gunners only, so I don't want them to go out there and... Uh, think they can fight with Ali when they haven't even, you know, they haven't even sparred yet. So they want to race. They're eager to race. They want to represent, but there's a lot of guidance that I'm trying to give them to emphasize on suspension and stuff like that. And um, they're taking it. So we just helped them out a lot just by giving them, forget about the parts, just by giving them the right guidance. And that's what we try to do in this movement and in this channel. So he's literally ready to tune. He's going to sit back and wait a couple of weeks and do it the right way, work on some of the suspension stuff I told him to do. And uh, when he comes out, he's going to be 110%. But, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. I hope you guys enjoy this entire week. Tomorrow we're getting more parts and we're uploading more. So, again, like, comment, subscribe. Keep going.